So, I have a collapsed lung. This is bullshit. Okay, they stuck a tube in here, in my lung, to expand it. And it actually hurts way more than the fucking uh, original pain that I had. I will be stuck in the hospital for a week. Holy dog shit. Anyway, we shall see. Well, I have a collapsed lung, and they had to install a tube to reinflate my lung. They're going to put me on some antibiotics. And I'll be in the hospital for five days. And um, other than automatically everything being Charlie Victor one niner, now they said I might have a little pneumonia. Hmm. Okay, now. Well, this is my one, two, third day in the hospital. Being hooked up to uh, multiple of uh, IVs and, of course, oxygen. <clears throat> All due to my pneumonia, which I, I believe they missed, but... We're a day late and a dollar short with that. They're going to assess me hopefully here the next day or two to take this tube out of my lung that is uh, supposedly collapsed. I don't know. I mean, I'm still having... A little difficulty breathing <coughs> without a cough but yet they've dumped in all kinds of antibiotics and viral stuff in fact they make sure I have a shot in the stomach it helped eliminate the possibility of uh, blood clots and then of course the medication itself possibly cause damage to the liver. <sighs> so I'll have to make a decision with my release from here and then my, after my birthday to whether or not I can really stay around. Because the number one problem, in my opinion, is every place is friggin' cold. Every place. I think I probably had the pneumonia for over a month. And it got worse that Monday. So we shall see. Well, this is my one, two, third day in the hospital. Being hooked up to uh, multiple of uh, IVs and, of course, oxygen, <clears throat> all due to my pneumonia, which I, I believe they missed, but we're a day late and a dollar short with that. They're going to assess me, hopefully, here the next day or two to take this tube out of my lung that is uh, supposedly collapsed. I don't know. I mean, I'm still having a little difficulty breathing. 
without a cough. But yet they've dumped in all kinds of antibiotics and viral stuff. In fact, they make sure I have a shot in the stomach. It helped eliminate the possibility of uh, blood clots. And then, of course, the medication itself could possibly cause damage to the liver. So I'll have to make a decision with my release from here and then my, after my birthday to whether or not I can really stay around. Because the number one problem, in my opinion, is Every place is friggin' cold. Every place. I think I probably had the pneumonia for over a month. And it got worse that Monday. So we shall see. Well, this is my one, two, third day in the hospital. Being hooked up to uh, multiple of uh, IVs and, of course, oxygen, <clears throat> all due to my pneumonia, which I, I believe they missed, but we're a day late and a dollar short with that. They're going to assess me, hopefully, here in the next day or two to take this tube out of my lung that is uh, supposedly collapsed. I don't know. I mean, I'm still having a little difficulty breathing <coughs> without a cough. Yet they've dumped in all kinds of antibiotics and viral stuff. In fact, they make sure I have a shot in the stomach. It helped eliminate the possibility of uh, blood clots. And then, of course, the medication itself could possibly cause damage to the liver. I'll have to make a decision with my release from here and then my, after my birthday to whether or not I can really stay around. Because the number one problem, in my opinion, is every place is friggin' cold. Every place. I think I probably had the pneumonia for over a month. And it got worse that Monday. So we shall see. Well, this is my one, two, third day in the hospital. Being hooked up to uh, multiple of uh, IVs and, of course, oxygen, <clears throat> all due to my pneumonia. which I, I believe they missed, but we're a day late and a dollar short with that. They're going to assess me, hopefully, here in the next day or two to take this tube out of my lung that is uh, supposedly collapsed. I don't know. I mean, I'm still having a little difficulty breathing <coughs> without a cough. But yet they've dumped in all kinds of antibiotics and viral stuff. In fact, they make sure I have a shot in the stomach. It helped 
eliminate the possibility of uh, blood clots. And then, of course, the medication itself could possibly cause damage to the liver. So I'll have to make a decision with my release from here and then my, after my birthday to whether or not I can really stay around. Because the number one problem, in my opinion, is every place is friggin' cold. Every place. I think I probably had the pneumonia for over a month. And it got worse that Monday. So we shall see. Well, this is my one, two, third day in the hospital. Being hooked up to uh, multiple of uh, IVs and, of course, oxygen. <clears throat> All due to my pneumonia. which I, I believe they missed, but we're a day late and a dollar short with that. They're going to assess me hopefully here in the next day or two to take this tube out of my lung that is uh, supposedly collapsed. I don't know. I mean, I'm still having a little difficulty breathing <coughs> without a cough. But yet they've dumped in all kinds of antibiotics and viral stuff. In fact, they make sure I have a shot in the stomach to help eliminate the possibility of uh, blood clots. And then, of course, the medication itself could possibly cause damage to the liver. So I'll have to make a decision with my release from here and then my, after my birthday to whether or not I can really stay around. Because the number one problem, in my opinion, is Every place is friggin' cold. Every place. I think I probably had the pneumonia for over a month. And it got worse that Monday. So we shall see. Well, yesterday I had another test tube, a correction, uh, air tube installed. because a smaller one that was on the side of me. I can't really show it. Uh, came out. And they put this big bad boy in to reinflate the lung. Oy vey. I look like shit, but... I need to shave and have actually razors and stuff for that. So it looks like I'm on my, what's it, today is sixth day now here uh, with this thing in there. Don't know how much longer I'm going to be here. Probably looks like another week for sure. So uh, obviously I've lo lost some more weight. You know, just didn't want to lose a lot of muscle and firmness. So, anyway, I feel a little better. Breathing is fine, I think. So, Anyway, that's it. Thanks.
Well, yesterday I had another test tube, a correction, uh, air tube installed. Because the smaller one that was on the side of me, I can't really show it, uh, came out. And they put this big bad boy in to reinflate the lung. Oh, hey, I look like shit, but I need to shave and have actually razors and stuff for that. So it looks like I'm on my, what's it, today is sixth day now here uh, with this thing in there. Don't know how much longer I'm going to be here. Probably looks like another week for sure. So um, obviously I've lo lost some more weight. You know, just didn't want to lose a lot of muscle and firmness. So anyway. I feel a little better. Breathing is fine, I think. So, anyway, that's it. Thanks. Well, yesterday I had another test tube, a correction, uh, air tube installed, because the smaller one that was on the side of me, I can't really show it, uh, came out. And they put this big bad boy in to reinflate the lung. Oh, hey, I look like shit, but I need to shave and have actually razors and stuff for that. So it looks like I'm on my, what's it, today is sixth day now here uh, with this thing in there. Don't know how much longer I'm going to be here. Probably looks like another week for sure. So, um, obviously I've lo lost some more weight. You know, just didn't want to lose a lot of muscle and firmness. So, anyway... I feel a little better. Breathing is fine, I think. So, anyway, that's it. Thanks. Well, yesterday I had another test tube, a correction, uh, air tube installed, because the smaller one that was on the side of me, I can't really show it, uh, came out. And they put this big bad boy in to reinflate the lung. Oh, hey, I look like shit, but I need to shave and have actually razors and stuff for that. So it looks like I'm on my, what's it, today is sixth day now here uh, with this thing in there. Don't know how much longer I'm going to be here. Probably looks like another week for sure. So, um, obviously I've lo lost some more weight. You know, just didn't want to lose a lot of muscle and firmness. So, anyway... I feel a little better. Breathing is fine, I think. So, anyway, that's it. Thanks. So here I am shaving. I run a lot of electrical wires <laughs> and stuff.
Ahí tuve. Pami. necessarily show myself shaving I just kept having the camera turn off the water's cold. One of these alcohol things here. Which will probably burn like hell. Try not to lean on any cables or any goddamn hoses. Or drop water on electrical friggin' wires.
All right. That's all she wrote. Let's see. Unfortunately, I can't find my toothbrush, so. Maybe tomorrow. Well, holy shit, that tube is gone. And um, it hurt like hell. It's literally about six inches long. Here we go. Hopefully the x-ray is okay, and then tomorrow or the next day, hopefully go. All right. Well, this is what a hurricane looks like from my hospital room. Do nothing to show too much. Or the beginnings of the uh, hurricane. Still here though. Maybe today, <laughs> when they're supposed to have the hurricane kick in for sure, they're supposed to be released, so we'll see. Well, today is September the 15th, my birthday, and it's now 8 a.m., and I'm supposed to be released today. <clears throat> Long is supposedly good, got to take it easy for two weeks. Which I'm going to do. Trying to figure out ways to make sure my body temperature keeps low when I'm outside when it's stupid hot. So we'll go from there. So anyway, happy birthday to me and Freedom Day. Uh, I have to do some maintenance work. Anyway, that's it. Well, September 15th is here, and I'm standing by for the wheelchair in the room here, and then to leave. I still have that little cough, though. They're saying it's no big deal. Take some over-the-counter stuff, which is fine. We'll see. Anyway. Happy birthday.